1090 uh, Jake speaks directly to Rallo. All right, let's hear hear like what Rallo and have to say. I don't think Rallo at this point. And his brother is on. Editing, it's cropping plain. out You're everything good. and putting things in the wrong place like it's a motherfucking song. Uh, his brother has moved words from one place to one another. He have he had to probably go to do Pro Tools or some type of shit. I can't you know this, about this type of shit, man. So honestly, bro, Just the brother talk, is completely misleading way. people into the wrong direction it's, and still trying to save face at the same head. time. However... No person on earth was affected sure. by <laughs> the position my lawyer did. My lawyer went and uh, made it look juicy. Like I said, made it look juicy for these individuals. Hello? That's what I'm going to say. What is my flaw? You at work out? Yeah. So do you mind me telling the internet if that he you didn't, why is he so comfortable for a federal phone talking that, uh, about him trying to run a trick on the, the no, U.S. Know attorney? That, I say, not a trick. You get what I'm saying? You my co-defendant. He had nothing to do with that case. So I don't know why the hell out of anybody I know. So wait, wait, like we missed the wait, wait, wait. Playing it, we missed that. Back the phone, bro. Yeah, he did. But what I'm trying, what I'm trying to clarify is that did I ever tell on you? You my co-defendant. You my little brother who tried to take the charge. Yes, but you could tell it the end of the I'm saying. Answer the question, like, did I? No, nah, you ain't never told me, nigga. Uh, I just want to make sure. I Hello? That's what I'm, that's what I'm he said, Where's yeah, bro, you was telling them that motherfucker, bro. He's like, huh? Like, yeah. That's a sentence. That's a sentence. That he, he said that just now. You didn't just hear it. He asked, he like, yeah, man, you was telling him. He was like, huh? Then he changed it up. Like, nah, man, you ain't never tried to tell him. I'm like, oh, bro. I heard that shit earlier. Even his man that he had. This is sad though. The script went bad. Bro, I feel like the most concerning thing though with this whole Rallo shit was during the call. Um, well, no, and his lawyers. I think it's on like page twelve, and 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 his lawyer stated, "Yo, like this case has to be sealed because he has given information on very prominent people in the ATL community." Um, and if this gets out, there'll be a danger to his security. Who can we pull that up? Nah, did y'all hear Flacco take on it? Who's the people that you said Rallo snitched on, though? I seen your video yesterday. Yeah, hmm. now, right, so, hey, so look, so again, when I hear that this man gave information on prominent people in the ATL community, yeah, the only prominent people that I know of is the YFN, YSL, et cetera, et cetera, right? And... According to Gossip of the City and WAG, that the 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 Atlanta DA Fannie Willis has a prominent rapper who was cooperating. Right now, mm -hmm. I don't know what again. I don't know what Rallo can tell him. Now I do know that Rallo and Young Thug was beefing at some point, and, and in, they all from the same city. It ain't about yeah. what he could tell him. Cause listen, bro, he he was considered the real nigga in the city. So the the, the gossip that's going around the city, that's like if somebody died today in Compton, and I go to the streets. Just me knowing the people that I know, seven times out of ten, I know the whole story before the end of the night. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? So yeah. Rallo can know a whole lot. I doubt that Rallo is telling them on them. But they he did say that he knew something about some murders yeah. and some other shit in there. He told other them that they could go through their phone, transactions, yeah. all type of stuff yeah. that was going on in Atlanta. So it's like... For him to say that he's making his lawyer do something juicy for the DA is crazy because yeah. it's like you trying to talk yourself out of this shit. He was mad that it even got out. He didn't know that one of his people was going to turn on him over this shit. He like, bro, the only reason you know this, I just made a post about this, is because it was uh, a, what, what they called it? Uh, oh, because uh, the... A uh, 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 prosecution. Uh, uh, the misconduct. Trial, misconduct. Yeah. Yeah, offer or whatever it is. They having a hearing about uh, misconduct in the prosecution. So what he's trying to expose loopholes because <laughs> the prosecution didn't take into consideration the proffer that he made, yeah. and he still got 10 years. You get what I'm saying? Like, I've been told you I trade these people mm -hmm. in for my time. And if you don't know in the feds, every person is two years. Mm -hmm. So when you fight them, and you, give, you give them one person, you get two years off your sentence. All you had to do was do five. Can you imagine <laughs> though, right? Bro, 
that pompous and, and arrogant ninja, he turned on his homies and then tried to turn on the feds and, 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 and the prosecutors and then sue them, right? Bro, bro the fuck is wrong? Nigga, listen, the prosecutors, if you are telling, they should be your number one friend. I mean, bro, listen, you should do whatever you can to cater them, right? Because, like, for example, right, look, 6 9 told, and he's been out for I don't know how long now, but the moment that he gets touched, the feds is coming running. They come and run. That's because he's cause he's steadily doing the right thing. Yeah. <laughs> he got robbed. Supposedly, he got his ass whooped. He called the police. He's probably yeah. this the thing. The motherfuckers that 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 that's still going around six nine and committing crimes. It's no question that somebody's going to jail every time <laughs> that he gets <laughs> pissed off. He's turning your ass in. So damn scary. Yeah, I mean, but as far as <laughs> Rallo, Rallo, you 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 put yourself in jail. You rapped about dog food in every song, man. Dog food is heroin for people who don't know what dog food is. You rapped about this in every song. Then you're on the plane posting millions. Hmm. Then when the feds finally get up on you, you happen to be on the plane yourself with the shit. I just said that. Like, you know what I mean? Like, you got to do better, man. And like you said, like his boy said, what you he's like, oh, I got caught on the plane with this shit. What was I supposed to do? You supposed to take your lick. Because his boy also told him that he was telling him to stop being so motherfucking flashy while they were still hustling. That's what was said on that first phone call. There ain't no editing that. That was your man's really pissed off. He his wasn't boy calling told him himself no too, though, right? Nigga. Brother, bro, listen, right, right listen, because his boy, like, got, like, real estate guru and all type of shit. And, and, and like in his bio, and then talking like to Rollo, like he's talking like a street nigga, right? Like so, like you know, so he's probably you be wolf. Nah, but like he's talking like, yo, bro, bro, I, I told you about this shit, my nigga. You got me right now. With Rollo is bro, like we know know that like in his music was not selling and hitting, right? To where he is up. Mm -hmm. Well, he and was buying his own music. I think that he bought that deal with Gucci, so he could he could flash it, but not not like that. But yeah, I don't see Gucci man giving Rollo a million dollars at the at the peak of Rollo's career. He, he wasn't worth, worth no million. Yeah. He wasn't worth a million dollars. Unless he was going to get half of his show money after he signed him to get the million, million back. What I think he did was gave Guwap a million cash and had him sign him for it. That's money laundering right there, though. It don't matter. That's crazy. You, you play That's money that. laundering, right? Like It don't matter. Right? I'm just telling you what I think happened. If you, like, sign me. Is that telling what you just right, did? Now, look. Now, look. If you sign me in, <laughs> under the guise to hide that I have... Illegal money and means that, like, that's your guap. Be careful, guap, right? <laughs> right, right, because, bro, <laughs> the money if that comes out, man, not. man, nigga, it's over for guap. My nigga. It's not Listen, money what, what I'm trying to tell you, that's breaking the law. What I'm trying to tell you, you was colluding and conspiring to nah, hide that man. Because, drug money. Nah, no, was, let me tell you this, but because he can. Now, it's all type of ways this shit can get flipped. Guap could have took that money for a, a mixtape. It'd been a million dollars for him to do these features. It doesn't have to. What if the deal never was signed in? What if it was never no check cut? Because now I got to defend Guwap because this guy turned into yeah. a cop. But what if it was yeah. never a check cut yeah, yeah, from yeah. So Icy mm -hmm. but or it's from, it's from, from money, Brick Squad? You get what if, he gave him, if Rallo gave Gucci a million in cash and then he gave him back that million clean in, in a check form. Nah, not right, not right, not right. So look. If they say, bro, but white saying? people do this shit all the time, yeah. Flacco. So you you need to worry about them <laughs> money That's laundering. The same way they try Just to catch you. I mean, if they so so say, listen, right? yeah. so listen. If you needed check stubs, right, mm -hmm. and you were out of business, but you you paid somebody in order to show that you needed that you had check stubs, so you paid yourself through somebody else's company every month. Uh, as falsified and, and business records. You a favor, if they were doing that's you a, a favor because you were trying to move, <laughs> say you were trying bro, to move, that's you a wouldn't crime. do that. Yeah, that's crazy. Huh? Shit, me, nah, bro. Every week. Me, nah, man, nah, man. I can do that. I follow the law, bro. This break. nigga, this mm. nigga takes the badge. Dog, bro, listen, bro, <laughs> bro, but look, bro, look, Trump just got hit with thirty-eight yes, felonies gotcha. for falsifying business records. <laughs> just one of them right there. You feel yeah, me? What, bro? What I'm like, you gonna run for you? You you plan on jumping into politics when we get older, bro? Hell nah. Sure, I, I was in born hell here. Nah, you can still. You can be a lot of people that wasn't born yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, nah, yeah, nah. You can be everything but president. Like, nah, bro. What's the point then? You could be like a councilwoman, a councilwoman. <laughs> a, a, a woman. 
Hey, yo, pause. Hey, yo, pause, nigga. Hey, yo, pause. 